Well, let's bring you back home now. And dozens of sick and injured seals in Cape Town are now facing an uncertain future. The Hout Bay Seal Rescue Center may soon be forced to close. It's been operating from two lots at the Hout Bay Harbor for over two decades, thanks to a verbal agreement with a major fishing company. But now, the Public Works Department will be opening a tender process for the leasing of that property. Monique Mortlock went there to go take a look. When Hope arrived at the Hout Bay Seal Rescue Center in November 2019, she was sick and suffered from seizures. Now, she's healthy, can hunt on her own, and is ready to be released into the ocean. She's one of dozens of Cape Fur seals that have been rescued and rehabilitated. But time is running out for these animals and the people who care for them as an open tender process is in the works for the lease of the property. We have tried to engage with Department of um, Public Works around the center, which is, please can you give us, we understand that you want to put things out to tender, but we do not have the capacity to, to bid against wealthy corporations or wealthy individuals. Kim Krynor says they're hoping to enter into a standalone lease agreement with the department. Abel Banda has worked here for 10 years. He says he's worried about losing his livelihood, but also about what will happen to the seals, like the pups who still need care for at least two more years. What the animals are going to do here if this place is going to shut down? Definitely these animals are going to die. So I feel sorry myself for this place. The Public Works Department says it's willing to engage with the centre for an interim arrangement until the property is advertised via the open tender process. But it adds the leasing of state-owned properties must be done in accordance with the Constitution. Monique Mortlock, Cape Town.